Hey boogies, welcome back to the channel. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Turn on your notification bell so you can post a video and you know when I post a video. I just was live on um, TikTok a few minutes ago. I was just, I was just vibing and you know, just doing what I normally do on TikTok. Um, having fun and laughing through all my pain and stuff like that. So I got deep into it where I just plead out my heart and you know, been real and just tell how I'm really feeling about everything in the world itself. Um, and when somebody brought up a particular name, I'm not gonna keep calling up her name. When they brought up a particular name, I thought about the situation with this lady. Like, I just don't understand her. Like, she just don't like me with a passion when she don't know me. Brought, br brought that name up and I started reminiscing on things and started deeply getting to my feelings and my thoughts and addressing things that was going on in my life, in my past, in my future, or whatever. And I just started crying out of nowhere. You can't just person because they cry. A lot of people have a lot of hurt and pain in their heart that they don't like talking to nobody about and it builds up. And it can lead to suicide, suicidal thoughts, death, or whatever. So, me personally, I was, I've been out to social media to um feel feel better about what I'm going through in my life. Anyways, I just was on TikTok too as well. Somebody asked me for my cash app. That's why I don't give my cash app out when I'm live because the negativity that comes with it. They just stupid like that. So the girl texted me and was like, where your cash app? So I gave it to her and she texted back and she was like, bitch, da, 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 I got four kids, blah, blah, you got the platform. You do it. That's just a lot of evil and hateful shit in her mind. I think she's just mad because I do got the platform. But if you want to be out there, you can. You can't stop nobody from being out there. People can post one video that somebody might like and go viral overnight. You know what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, most of the time I try to get back on TikTok to vent out to get my views up on my YouTube channel because if they see that I'm on TikTok, you know where that's where all the views at. All the people at I mean, they'll come over to my YouTube channel and show some love to as well. But as being a single mom by choice, um I do show the world my life. Um day in and day out most of the time when I was on TikTok. Now I just basically do a live where I'm sitting in my car playing music or doing something that I love to do, let the world see what I'm doing. I feel like it shouldn't come with a lot of discrimination from a lot of people, but at the end of the day, I had over 1,000 of people came on the live when my tears started rolling. It shouldn't be like that. But at the same time, I do appreciate all the love and support that I did get from the app today, all the gifts and everything of that nature. Um, if nobody can't relate to what you got going on in your life, then they're going to be a hater. They're going to be evil and conniving and say things out of the ordinary. They're not supposed to say so. All I know is I just try to do the best I can to jump up on my YouTube channel to let you guys know how much I appreciate all y'all support on both of my channels, even though I'm mainly on my main account all the time posting videos. TikTok, um, people on there just, you know, like, I don't know, like a lot of them disrespectful and rude. And a lot of them are kids. Like, I guess they figure it was a kid's app. They can just get up there and still, you know, do things. But a lot of things that people post on that, on that app, such as, you know, dancing, booty, and all kinds of stuff. Kids seeing all that stuff. So, I got nothing to do with it. I just get on TikTok. I'm going back on TikTok to post videos and, you know, do a couple lives every now and then. And try to get my views up on my YouTube channel. So I can be all the way out there to where I can have money to, you know, pay these bills and be successful in what I'm trying to be successful in. And that's me and, like, trying to, you know, bigger house, bigger cars, more money. Kids want to go, you know, on trips or whatever. That's one thing I'm thinking about. I'm not thinking about anything negative. I'm not a negative person. With the comment that I addressed earlier, yeah, I do lie about things, especially when I need, when I really need it. You know, I do lie. We don't lie. We're not perfect. We're human. But every time you turn around and you dwell in negativity, you will be negative too. If you dwell in positive, you will be positive too. But at the same time, negative and positive do not mix. And that's one thing about me today on the live. I try to get on there, dance, laugh, whatever I can do to make sure anybody else that's having a bad day turn their day into a good day. That's the only thing I be trying to do with the world, man. People don't see my good. They always see bad in me. Like, I'm, I'm not understanding. I guess the realness that's in me that's driving them crazy. But I'm on the way now to take the garbage out. Let me get off that topic. Because I've been on TikTok talking for hours. Like, literally talking for hours. Like, on how I feel about my life, how I feel about this, how I feel about that. So the people that was on the live basically got a cup of tea. You know, they got a cup of tea. And when they get a cup of tea, they run with it. You know what I'm saying? They pour it out. They spill it. So it's just like, whatever I said on my live is on my live. Whoever screen recorded, screen recorded, they got it. I don't care. At the end of the day, like I said, but my mom, I love her. I forgive her, but I don't forgive her. I hate her, but I don't hate her. Like, it's, it's in between with my mom. Like, literally, you wasn't there for me through anything that I've been going through. You didn't even dwell to say, okay, you know, I love you or nothing. I mean, like, it's crazy. Like, the vibe is off with her. So, you know, like I said, I 
already spilled my beans out on TikTok. I already got it all out my system. So I hope you guys did enjoy watching the live today when I was live on there. Um, another thing I want to address is um, living situation is kind of like fucked up because I had some bad news. I had some good news. But I'm still trying to do some some other things. I know I can do it. You know, I know I can do it. I'm not going to sit there like I can when I can. My head hurts because I think I got the bones too tight. Um, otherwise, I gotta do what I gotta do to survive. I can't sleep here and just be laying around like if you can get out here and make a whole YouTube deal and get five or ten dollars off of it. Why not? Like literally why not? But at the end of the day, it's a lot of people that they ain't gonna just don't know me. Like if you really wanna know me, just grab the book off Amazon and go read it. Read all about Shanika Grant. If you put me in the Google box, like I said on my own TikTok, you will find Instagram pops up, um, and you know Facebook and everything of that nature. Otherwise, I'm about to get ready to go pick up trash, get the kids some pieces, and get the snacks that they asked for. Once I do all that, I'll go back to the house. I relax for a while. I change my clothes, and I head out to game plan. Um, it's necessary. It's necessary not saying that you want a lot of crime for help. People like for money. You crying out tears of joy. People get on that live sometimes. I watch other people lives. And they be up there, you know, doing battles. And, you know, some people be up there asking for money. Some people just be doing their normal thing like they normally do on TikTok. And that's one thing that I does when I get on TikTok. I just do my normal thing. I don't get up there and be trying to get no money. If I need it, I know who I can reach out to to ask. Because I know I pay that person back. But at the same time, I don't need nobody judging me on nothing that I do or nothing that I say. Because of the fact that they go, I am a content curator. I am a mother. I am... I am, I am somebody. Sorry, my camera on. Um, about to die. I just basically doing me, like doing me. This is something that I always wanted to do when I was young. I always wanted to be out there in the world, let the world know what I was going to do. Through all the rape and stuff that was going on in my household and stuff that's going on around me, that stuff stayed with me. You know what I'm saying? I, that's my past, but it's still like I still remember like yesterday. And one thing my kids don't have to never worry about is nobody harming them in any physical way or treating them any kind of way. And that's one thing I, I always address to people about my kids. Like, they're not going through no physical neglect, no abuse or anything of that nature. That it doesn't need to be addressed like that across the social media platforms. You know what I'm saying? Because it, it seems like the person that I'm talking about, the person that's in my head just have a grudge on me because of the realness that's in me. You know what I'm saying? I do lie. I say that so many times. I do lie. I'm human. You know what I'm saying? When I'm going, one person that's going to miss me is the people that that's dearly, that's close to me and that loves me and especially my damn children. You know what I'm saying? I'm not doing this for the sake of the world. I'm doing this for the sake of my children. And I'm, if I know I can go out and, and get a rental and get everybody on vacation or take them somewhere, that's what I want to do. I want to make them happy. I want to make sure they got the things that they need and want. I want to make sure that they when we travel or we do something a little bit different besides me getting up on my um, YouTube channel, talking to you guys, showing y'all the clouds, eating food, um, taking out, doing mother duties. You know what I'm saying? But that's the only thing I know. That's why my channel is uh, Reality and Motherhood with Miss Nika because I'm showing y'all reality right now. I'm showing y'all like what I'm doing. Like literally motherhood is when I'm in there feeding the kids or the kids getting their hair done. Or we going out to doctor's appointments. It's, that's why my channel was, that's what my channel is designed for. Reality and motherhood. And that's the thing that I do as a content creator. Like I show y'all the, the real, like I show y'all the real shit. Like I want to show y'all more. I want to show y'all, you know, inside of my house when I cook, you know, but when we do things now, most of the time I used to get live and go cook. We cook in our house now. I don't show nobody the inside. Y'all seen the inside when I was sitting down. Y'all was looking behind me. Wanted to see the whole house. No. It doesn't work like that. So I'm basically just up here just venting out to you guys now. Letting you guys know I'm out running errands. And, you know, it's raining outside today. So I'm going to go ahead and dump this trash out. I hope you guys enjoy. Um, I hope that trash can ain't broke. Alright, I'm going to dump the trash out, y'all. Mother job is never done. That's all you got right there? Mm -hmm. Oh. You need help? Ha <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> hey, no. I don't have stuff to worry about. Look at all the stuff I'm um, wasting the damn shit all over my seat. Sick, man. Boy, I could have put that junk in the bag for real. I told him I, that's why I set the bag on the top. It lays as fuck, don't want to do nothing. That's the shit I be talking about. Look at this clean pull ups in the trash. Come on, man. Like I said, um, I got the trash dump out. I told the boys to keep the bag in it. So, and, um, throw that junk in there, little man. It won't get stink. They must be moving or something. They ain't something. Oops. All the pollen, I just washed my car. I got my car right back dirty. But them boys lazy. But Papa got this job now, so he's gonna be working his ass. He's he gonna work 24 7. He can't work all the time because, yeah, they ain't gonna have that kind of um, We only got one transportation, and that's me picking up everybody. So, he can work as much as he wants, but he got to work around each other. They, they both have to work around each other's schedule. And I already know her schedule, what time she was working. But it's like I told him, you tell the man, you go tomorrow, tell him, you know, whatever. But she finally get, you know, get the hell out of the house. You know, paycheck started coming. He really going to love that. I think, I think um, they direct the cost. Yeah, and they get early pay. Yeah, they get early pay, so he be good to go. So if he need gas money, he can get it out. Well, he going to have his gas money. <laughs> Teach that boy responsibility. If I don't teach him, he ain't gonna learn. Cause his daddy got him spoiled. Daddy do everything, and you already know since Papa was a baby. But anyways, now I'm headed to go get these damn pieces for these kids and get these snacks right quick. Mom, that's what I'm about to do right now. If I ain't cooking till late, I don't even know what to cook. All this pork chops, put in the damn air fryer. She be so good. Mm. I'm about headed. I don't think they had the Hershey's in this dollar store yet. I'm headed to Dollar Store first. No, I'm headed to a piece of place first. Then come back to the Dollar Store. And it pieces right here. You want to call?
just you gotta figure out how to get it out. Like I be literally thinking about that shit. Like yo, I've been already out there, like out there. I'm trying to get pull that shit back in the hat. Where I can get all the way out there, out there. But my YouTube channel can get enough views to make sure these bills are being paid the way it's supposed to be paid, which they are being paid. I'm managing my money. You know what I'm saying? But at the same time, I gotta figure out a way. There's a doorway, and it's open. I just gotta go through it. That's it. And once I get through that door, I'm not gonna stop. And I, and I didn't realize how much fame I had until after the fact. I didn't know. I didn't know all that shit, yo. I did not know that. Like I was literally out there on my first, on my first TikTok platform. I went viral when I was in the meetings. I was out there. Yo. I didn't. I didn't know all that. I was out there. That's why that person that texted you on Instagram, some of your stupid ass mama, back out, back out there, famous again. Oh, yeah. I didn't. I didn't know all that shit. I didn't know that. So I'm trying to pull it back. I'm trying to walk through that door and close it and stay right there where I'm at. Cause these people think I'm fucking playing. I'm, I'm trying to get money to make sure me, we we set. Like I'm paying these bills and everything now, rent and all that shit. Like I've been doing. It's just the fact that they gon' money goes like it goes so fast. I'm not making them enough money to they gon' handle what I need to handle. Cause when, when I'm done with everything, I'm broke. But I do manage to they gon' go to Bingo and try to flip a little something. Cause Bingo ain't shit. It's like ten, twenty dollars you can get in. So you can make a dollar and fifteen cent any day. This is how you how you go about doing it. You ain't got no job. You ain't working. So how you taking care of responsibility? Man, I'm living in the place right now. I'm paying rent and everything. Like what? Once people see your platform, they automatically think, "Oh, she getting paid." Cause yeah. you already know that. Which is weird with that shit. But I ain't getting paid the money that I really want. That's the thing. Right. And I'm trying to get there. That's why I get on TikTok. And 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 you got to get on different places, platforms. I always say start with communication, dedication, and motivation in order to be successful in this lifestyle. Like, in my lifestyle, like my lifestyle, in my life period. I don't understand people. Like, I'm trying to do what I gotta do. Like, I got 10 kids. I'm raising them. I'm doing this shit. I'm doing it. And I get a lot of hate. You get too much hate. I get so much hate. I'm like, what the hell is going on? Like, I'm literally like, when I come across as a comment, like, negative fucking comment. Like, what? What is it that Nika's doing that's causing y'all to act the way y'all act? Like that girl by my cash app. Like I knew it was something with that. That's why I gave it to her. I knew it was fishy. That's why I'm texting people back. That's why I don't respond on my live. That's the reason why I don't respond. Because I don't have time for the negativity bullshit. The shenanigans bullshit that they pulling. They with that dumb shit. Not everybody. Now, I ain't I ain't addressing that for everybody. I'm just addressing that for the people that just damn that don't they see, know what they be doing. That don't see good in Nika. I got mothers out here beating the hell out of their kids and doing all kinds of stuff. My kids don't even get no discipline. Oh, you heard about that case? What? The, um, it's a white family. The girl, 14 years old, she called the police. She told the um, police that her mama and her daddy had raped her. And they told they, they told the police, the parents told the police it was true. But they said they was doing it to teach her about intercourse before she go out there and do it with a stranger. The daddy got more charges than the mom. He put his nasty slut. That, that was sick. They must have thought they was on the hub or something. It's going viral everywhere too. Mama named Shamika, she a white lady. And then the man named John, I think. And they said, yeah, they did it? They told the police, yeah, they did it. They admitted to it. And they told the police why. That's sick, that's your daughter and you, and that's the, the daddy. Like you watching him do this to her and you doing it too? That, that yeah, that was crazy. Mm -mm. So you never know what nobody going through in their household. Yeah, it could have been their first time. She just now called the police though, cause she old enough. They probably been doing that since she was a little right. And they got like two or three other kids. They're sick and nasty. They need to get themselves together, bro. You know what I'm saying? The kids that need help not get it. Nope. Well, we ain't been getting it when we was coming up. We wasn't getting it either. That's why I address my um life on, on out here to these people on, on the internet. Like, literally, the things I've been through in my life, my kids does not go through none of that shit. The CPS shit that I went through with my mom is, a, is similar to what my kids went through, but my kids, uh, we was on paper. My grandma had to get custody of us, yo. Or we was gonna be separated and be in a foster home. So my grandma took us in. Even though my grandma was shrieking, I thought it was love, it was never love, yo. It was more evil than anything. Like she just tr treated me like a slave, yo. I was going from, from heartbroken to my feelings being, oh, I love. You know, I, that's why I love so hard. I love so deep. Like I said, I told hey when I said, I, I mean, I've been with him 10 years and then I take so much from him because I wanted the love. You know? If I wasn't getting the love when I was a kid, how am I getting it now? The love I get now is from my children. That's the only love I have. The deepest love I have. Anyway, that's the 
deepest love is why I say I don't know what love is because I got trust issues from being my childhood life until now I got so many trust issues yeah. and it's hard to fix that I might have marriage right in front of me one day and we'll never know because of my because of my life so that's why I put my past behind me and move forward shit you know yo you ain't see this car fool you looking down you about to tee me up you just say it myself I got a piece and I sit down for a minute. It's cold on the inside. Sorry. I felt it vibrate on my butt. Alright, y'all, we got the pizza joint. Mm. I took my earrings off. I don't know where I put them. We got the pizza Oh boy, we got the pizza place. Mm. Am I tripping? Fabulous. I lost my earrings. My earrings in the window in the, in the house. That's my lashes. Huh? That's my lashes. What? In the window in the house. Your earrings is in the window in the house. I put it in there last night. Both of them? The hoops, they was on the floor. I got two of them. Two pills. I need this damn piece for these babies. How much is the piece Eighteen something. I'm gonna call Keisha back in a minute. Get my stuff together. So, this is the comment I was telling y'all about. She asked for my cash out. So, I gave it to her and then she responded back like this. That's the reason why I don't give out my cash out on TikTok when I'm live. But, real recognize real. And at the end of the day, I did a live and I plead out my heart. But, this is ridiculous. So, this is the comment I was telling y'all about. She asked for my cash out. So, I gave it to her and then she responded back like this. That's the reason why I don't give out my cash out on TikTok when I'm live. But, real recognize real. And at the end of the day, I did a live and I plead out my heart. But, this is ridiculous. So, this is the comment I was telling y'all about. She Some people just go through so much stuff they go through in their life. They're just trying to bring other people down. And that just don't make no sense. I mean, you don't ask for nobody to cash out and you bash them like that. You don't do that. I would never in a million years do some shit like that. Well, some people want to play for my what you got. They do. They they do. They aiming for it. But you got, I don't know. Like, I just literally got on TikTok and just blew up because the video that I post on Leah. I mean, not Leah. Um, Yeah, Leah dropping the baby. But the one that Naya posted, we was just, she was just playing around. She was little. Posted. I didn't know it was posted until <laughs> Tossie Kaya reposted. Tossie Kaya, the reason why I'm out on? here. Because she put it out and then everybody ran over there on the TikTok. I still was posting during that time. I was doing my thing during that time. I wasn't worried about no damn TikTok. I was just posting videos and posting whatever I could post. You know what I'm saying? Now that I'm officially out there, out there, now I got to be careful what I post because the fact that my children's life is in jeopardy like that. So I, I, I can't, you know, I can't say I want to change back the hand of time because, you know, I don't want to be famous, but I mean, it's out there, out there. What, what do you call it? If it ain't famous. That's what they say. They say, nigga, you ain't famous. Okay. You could be that though. You got to stick this in there. What is that? My um, bank card. You ain't calling people? Oh, shit. That's what I was supposed to be doing besides reading people comments. You would have been ready by the time you got here. You been on the phone. I was sitting on top of it. I know that. I don't understand though. If you had negativity to get to you, it'll drain you. It's like a drainage pipe. Like you just clogged up. Like you can't get undrained. That's just exactly how I feel right now. To this point right now, where I'm sitting in this in this car, like I feel drained from being on all the negativity that went that went on around me for the last couple of days from these ignorant people. All right, so we right here at the spot. I'm good. Yeah. We got a perfect match. Bruh. You always do it. Hey. Lipstick glossy. Mm. We waiting. Y'all got to listen to the bathroom. from. Bam. I ain't putting no spray or nothing. I put the oil on them. You got this spray right here? There's some good spray. This bath and body. What do I do with my spray? Your spray is. My baby done took the top off of it. Off mine. This is nice. And one thing about that bathroom body work shit, it, oh shit, it'll last for a little bit. What you getting? Cheese and pepper? Cheese and pepper on it, because that's what they want. See, got a lotion, I did. I don't know where to top it, but I carry it. Hey, can I order one cheese and one pepperoni pizza, um, please? It smells good. It smells like, like, yes. Love, it smells like a love spill. Yes. Sir? My baby. Oh, uh, no, thank you. 
my hair is dead. Really Yo, Naya put me on again. Cause I used to have the pink. Naya. I'm in your room. Yeah, Naya. They should know exactly who he is. Okay, thank you. It's right here. This is the one I just got the other day. But this is the other one. This is the main one. This one right here real good. I used to use this all the time. I need to stop at charging it up. Cut that super fat. But I need I had had this for a long time and I got this one out. But these things right here. Oh well, we gotta go to the jailhouse. Is good and it and it charge your phone fast. I gotta charge this one. I got I can't forget about this one. We'll go to the jailhouse or what? The fuck? Come on with you, bruh. Oh, they know you just ate something. Go on. We gotta go see somebody. We ain't gonna see nobody in no fucking jail. Okay. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and wait on this piece of here. I'm gonna sit my purse back in the back seat where it belongs. I gotta put my seat back on the seat, and it's gotta be washed. That's why I put um, told Kai to put it in the car. I'm gonna wash my car. Bruh. All right, that's a book. Wow, um, I'm gonna go use the bathroom. I gotta take it to him. earrings down this car. See, I usually put my jewelry on, but um, I'm gonna pawn everything I had to pay bills that time when I was going through bankruptcy. All right, let me go ahead and call Keisha right quick. Pondering? Um, not really much. Let me go ahead and call Keisha and, and chat with her, and I'm gonna talk to y'all back on this blog once we go back and get the pieces. Um, again, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, turn notifications when we post a video. Ain't no one post a video. I'm trying to drop a video as much as I can this whole month because Easter is. I think Easter at the end of this month. No, Easter is in April now. Oh wow. Wow. Okay y'all. So I'm gonna go ahead and finish off this video once we get the pizza and I'm gonna end it off. I hope you guys continue enjoying the vlog. Come over to my TikTok, watch the lives when I do go live. And I enjoy I thank you guys for your support on all my platforms. And I love you boot geeks. Anyway. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, turn the notification bell when I post that video. See y'all guys, what say it with me? Later, later, later. Peace to the Middle East. Deal for these kids. All right, y'all. So we had the Dollar Tree about to get ready to walk inside and get these kids stuff that they asked for from their favorite store. Of course, I'm running in to get it for them. Hope you guys continue enjoying the vlog. Work on, and that's what I'm working on. You know, every day. That's why I say I'm getting overwhelmed because I'm trying to do everything by myself without Haywood, you know, not around helping me. Like it's literally overwhelmed. Right. So I'm doing it though. So you know. Okay. He said he wanted Jolly Ranchers and Takis and Hershey's. No, he gave me his money for his. I don't see the Jolly Ranchers. This is what I be talking about when I come in this damn store for these kids. No, I don't see it. What are you saying? I don't got nothing. I don't see it. Hold on, Keisha. Try to turn the camera on. Let you see I'm in here. I don't see no Hershey. I ain't see nothing in here. Hold on. They got everything set for down to call the house. I'm in here. Look at this. It's stacked up, but it don't got what you need. I mean, everything in here, but it's just. I don't know what it is. All right, he's going to get something different. Jolly Ranchers, I had bought a big bag yesterday for $2.50 on Family Dollar. Everybody eat up. Get this record. We gotta meet up soon. I know, I know, I'm trying to go. I got to go. Pork chops in the air fryer. Probably with some mashed potatoes and corn, something that we eat normally all the time. That's what I'm doing now. I'm trying to. The piece is still hot, so I'm trying to get these snacks and then run back to them. Mm-hmm. Y'all want to get some gummy? Shit, my damn mouth. Hey, y'all, like, go to Colorado on that video. I should explain to me. I went in there. Let me tell you something, girl. I had. I went to what I did. I had went. I didn't plan it. I just did it. Right. See what I'm saying? So I had to plan it. I would have had you came there. But we, we plan it again. Like I told you, plan it again. So when I plan again, we definitely, most definitely want you to go. You gonna leave gonna eat the white chocolate now or no? No. Yeah, I remember that was probably the last time I spoke to you. You know something? Yeah. Um, you was like, oh, I'm trying to. I think you said I'm trying to plan a surprise for these kids or whatever. And whoop, there you go. They're gonna look wrong with you. Yeah, they got some chips. Yep.
But my kids deserve, you know, the best life. Money for that? Well. Like, I'm, I'm out here trying to make the money. You know, I'm making the money. So, I'm just giving them, you know, the life that they want. He just got chocolate milk in his hand when I walked in the house. Huh. I said, I'm gonna give him some chocolate. I'm gonna get a bucket. You want some more? Um, right here? Oh, they got more stuff done. I got these. You didn't use the gas. Excuse me. Where you see some chocolate milk at? I said, if we're doing this out, I don't know. Give me some more bottles. My pants keep coming up, bro. Oh, you said it's a. Shit. Yeah, it's raining every day. I'm, you know, peed up myself at the time I get to the front time. You working? Y'all got the key for the bathroom? I push it in. We'll come over. Let me see. Somebody in both of them? I'm going in the man's pocket. There ain't no man's all gender. Hurry up. We not done yet? What's the rush? Just turn it on. Just turn it on. I'll just turn the video. Hey, what about no video? What about getting out the stove? They ain't got none for you. I'm trying to show you everybody's flip-flops. Like chocolate, white chocolate. I ain't no. Hey, baby. What's the matter? 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 What's the
Hey ma'am, what you want? Pepperoni cheese, what you want? Uh, pepperoni cheese. Uh, cheese. Uh, mama. What? 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 I Hold on, I got y'all stuff. Hold on, okay? You have to eat first. Kira, get in the car. I don't want no pizza. You're going to get pizza, you're not getting no, no snacks. Sorry. I'll get it. Ain't what you want. You're going to eat today. Have a seat. Have a seat. You're going to have to eat pizza now or you're not getting a snack. I'm sorry. You're not going to get a snack. I don't want nothing. Right? No. What's so many of y'all? Close the door and stop yelling in my ear. Here, eat this pizza. You're going to eat the pizza or you're not getting a snack? Because y'all not getting no candy so y'all eat this pizza. Get at the Kira. I'm on the Kira. Come on, Kaya. Cheese, pepperoni. Kaya, cheese, pepperoni. Eat your food for Uh, Mama, I don't want um, one right now. Y'all not getting no snacks then? Yeah. Yep. Go eat. Eat. Stop eating your snacks. Do you want to get off the top of my car? Um, I'm you know, I'm you to go to the other house and then I fall to the Oh, the never mind. Oh, hello. It's Ow. Who closed the door? Okay. You. No, by no, myself. You do it. You do it. You do it. All right, give you a dollar back because I didn't have your own. Um, your other chocolate, I'll give you a dollar in a minute. There you go. That's eight. Um, here. Five you say chocolate milk? Mom. Ooh, no, chocolate milk. No, 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 no. I'm going to the grocery store. Kira. Where's okay. my chalky stuff? Selena. Sa. I ordered for talkies, but I heard she kisses. Yeah, I said blue. I got a big bag of talkies in the house. Oh. Are they Cheese or pepperoni? Or both? She. She. Yeah. And damn, I got her some candy. I'm, mm. Oh, I need a dollar for That's what we want. Here. I know he said something about that. No, he don't get no Hershey candy. He said white Hershey. Who said that? Uh, Papa ain't got no white Hershey candy here. Mom, he said white Hershey candy. They should get one out of his pack. I ain't had no. I ain't no. Get us a Papa Lee. For what? This? Yeah. Y'all drink all the drinks in the house? I got more drinks in the um in the room. I'll get it for you. Huh? Close that house door, man. Can I get some? Can I get some? It's fine. Wait, I can just drink. I'm going in and get it. I'm going in and get it. Let her trace off. Mm-mm. Let her trace off. Mm-mm. Let her trace off. So don't forget to what, y'all? Welcome oh, God. God. Turn on that what? No, I can't get back. I'm supposed to be y'all. See y'all what? Later. Yeah. Later, later, later. Yeah. Come on, y'all. Let's do it together. Yeah. 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 Thanks for, for watching. I'll see y'all guys back in our next video. I'll see you guys later, later, later. Peace to the Middle East.